Hospital or clinic or center. Mm -hmm. Not yet a hospital, it's a health center three. Okay. Yeah, and we offer all services. Uh, yes, we give mm -hmm. medicine, uh, we give uh, HIV and AIDS counseling. Mm -hmm. um, so you also give things like the ARVs? Yes, we yeah. do give ARVs. Which are the most common? Yeah, yeah I saw the posters. Yeah. The yeah. HIV, yeah. what sort of numbers do you get? Uh, on for, daily basis? for HIV, it can be like 500. <laughs> Wow, uh, large, so it's a very large proportion yeah. of the clinic. Yeah. And, and how, much, how much staff do you have working mm -hmm. in HIV? Uh, we are 14. 14, wow, and you're seeing 500 patients a day. Yes, we mm -hmm. are 14, but okay. anyway, we are, we are two organizations in yeah. here. Yeah. Um, the HIV and AIDS department. Okay, is it yeah. for children, adults, or all ages? For everyone, mm -hmm. for children and adults, right okay. from um, one month or right from at birth yeah. up to when God calls so you. We have a look at some of your people yeah. and facilities. Yeah. Yeah. These are like the um, clinics or assessment rooms that tend to happen here. And we've also got some containers also. Hey, hi, we're with um, Dr. Maria Teresa at the HIV Centre. Um, so, Maria Teresa, if you could um, just let us know exactly what HIV and AIDS is. Starts, okay. It's an RNA virus, yeah. so it codes into DNA, okay. and this yeah. DNA comes and attaches into the host cell DNA. Okay. So yeah. unless you find a way to destroy the host cell DNA, you can't, then you can't release. Okay. That makes it incurable. Yeah. So that is HIV, human yeah. immune yeah. virus. Okay. Then AIDS per se is acquired immunodeficiency syndrome, mm -hmm. meaning that uh, someone has gotten infected with the HIV virus. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then they've gone through the different stages of the what? Yeah. Of the viral infection. Yes. And then AIDS is probably what we call stage four. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, that means the most severe form of the HIV infection. Okay, okay. right. And yeah. How, in this particular area in Kampala, in Uganda, mm -hmm. how widespread or prevalent is this problem? Um, in the central region is where we have the highest concern, okay, like the highest number of clients with the, who are HIV positive. Yeah. The number of kids. Okay, yeah. Oh yes, you are asking about transmission. Uh, yeah. For many of these children, for most of them, we can safely say it was mother to child transmission. Mm -hmm. Then we have uh, our PMTCT program, yeah. uh, prevention of mother to child transmission. Yeah. There we have uh, our pregnant, the pregnant mothers, the HIV positive mothers. And, uh, lastly, um, how does HIV and AIDS impact the life expectancy in this part of the world so the average male or mm. female um, <coughs> you know unless they get treated mm. um, do we see a lot of mortalities yes now um, with the advent of treatment we have uh, fewer deaths due to HIV because yeah. at least in this facility we don't have more than 20 mortalities in Naya that I can report. Okay, right. So, so, so it keeps the life expectancy to yes. sort of normal level. Yes, to yeah. normal so levels. As long as they get regular treatment. And is yes. the treatment once a week or once no. a day? Once daily. Once daily. Okay, okay. no, not once daily. Okay, it's daily because it yeah. depends. Yeah. Some clients take twice a day, others yeah. take once okay. a day. Okay. Are they more prone to, to, to getting other infections and diseases because of if they do have HIV or AIDS? Yes, uh, but it is dependent on their adherence to their ARVs. Yeah. If they are adhering to their ARVs, they are less likely to get yeah. other infections. Okay. Mm -hmm. But if they are not adhering well, then they get they get yeah. severe. They tend to get more severe infections. Okay. So, yeah. We just want to thank you for your time. Um, it's good to see the facilities. You can see there's many many patients outside, which yes. we we can't really film too much. But um, mm. we uh, we just want to thank you for your time. So yeah, all the very best. Nice to meet you. Thank you.
<laughs> this, is the, this is the young girl, her name is Peace. Uh, she has been tested and she is HIV positive. Um, she, she comes here uh, on a daily basis for treatment. No, 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 Every month. Yeah. And Peace is four, four years old, nearly, nearly five. Grandmother? Yes. Two? Or? Yeah. Okay, so the grandmother here is saying she also has HIV too. Um, so they, they attend this clinic quite regularly, frequently, to ensure they take their medication. Well, it's, you can also understand because transport is not cheap, food is not cheap, so well, it's good. She's a volunteer here. She's also HIV positive tested, and her son also has it, unfortunately. One of my twin sons. Yes, and she's volunteering her time to help others who also have this condition. It was lovely meeting you, please. For sure, for sure. Uh, some beans, uh, maybe a pack of plastic plates which you can reuse over and over again. And this is something different. This is, uh, in case you want a little notice board or something, it's actually a chalkboard. Mm. It comes out as a roll type. Mm. You can write with chalk. You can use chalk on it. Mm. It's actually a chalk. It's first, it's first time I've seen this. Now maybe you just try it and. You're going to use it. Huh? You're going to use it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I do demonstrations. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I educate. Just use strong yeah. blue and put some yeah. this one. People. Yeah. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Let's get on. There is even Trevor here. You know how to play. Even, even, even Trevor. Trevor. All right, Trevor. Come on. 